Alright guys, so here I'm going to take you through some of the basic stuff. It's not basic, but this is, I've just gotten so good on the ball and uh, I'm a big fan of it. So I'm just doing single leg bird dogs. I'm spreading my fingers out. I mean, there's a lot of strategy involved in balancing on the ball. Here I'm making a cool transition. The goal is to not touch the ground at all and I do not touch the ground here. Okay, so I was able to turn around on the ball and part of it is just and here is a half kneeling stability hold okay so what I'm doing is I'm actually clinging the back of the ball with my with my toes and here I'm kind of just using a lot of support by limbs legs and hands working together with core stabilization I want to show you the side view if you look look at the look at my foot that's on the ball in the back I'm using my anterior tibialis to dorsiflex my foot so I can stabilize just doing different arm motions there now I'm just balancing on the ball here. I'm a big fan of using the ball. I really think this is like cream of the crop in terms of coordination training and just, you know, st stimulating your nervous system in, in a very effective way. Here I'm going to try and transition into a prone Superman without touching the ground. And I did it. Unfortunately, the bench is blocking, but my foot is not touching the ground in the back. Just holding it, and now I'm going to go over the top. So that was my first um, fall there. This is <laughs> its crazy how quick I was able to just come up like that. You know, when I do it, I don't think about it, but seeing it, it just looks kind of crazy. Did not touch the ground. There, I touched. Different strategies, too far. Too far. I'm just trying to keep my talking to a minimum here, guys, just because I want you guys to appreciate, just, just to see this, you know, instead of, that's tough. To separate the ball like that, both of them, it's, it's incredible hip, hip stability. There I had to just bail out. And I've, done, I've been able to do that before. I don't know if I, yeah, I do do it actually. Here. Yeah, it's, again, a half kneeling on, on two balls. I'm actually pinning them together, which creates stability. So it's a lot of muscular effort to kind of control the ball. There I just slipped off. Try to do half kneeling on the other side. That was pretty cool. I don't know if you guys realize, but I actually transitioned from on being on both balls to one without touching the ground. So it's coming to an end, guys, but this training is just so brain, you know, it's so neurological in a sense that it's just, it takes, there's a bird dog. It takes a lot of uh, stabilization with the opposite side leg and the hand that's on the ball. You have to kind of groove those patterns of forces to balance. So anyhow, that's it guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching.